In this video, we will learn about group 17 elements, also known as halogens. Halogens are located at the 17th column of the periodic table and the elements consist of fluorine, chlorine, bromine, iodine, astatine, and tennessine. Since this is a beginner's guide video, I will be focusing on four main elements in the halogens group, which are fluorine, chlorine, bromine, and iodine. Now, let's begin with looking at their physical appearances of these elements in their diatomic molecule state. The fluorine molecule is seen as pale yellow gas at room temperature, while chlorine appears as yellow green gas at room temperature. Bromine exists as dark brown liquid, however, when heated, bromine turns into brown vapor. Whereas iodine appears to be black solid at room temperature and turns into purple vapor when heat is applied on it. Having to know about their appearances, it is also worthy to note that all these halogens cannot conduct heat or electricity in any of their physical states. Most importantly, they are all able to produce poisonous fumes. Which is why any experiments involving these halogens must be conducted in a proper fume hood. Additionally, you can protect yourself by wearing a proper mask while conducting the experiments. Moving on, let's have a look at how electrons are arranged in halogen atoms. The table here has the proton and electron arrangement for fluorine, chlorine, and bromine. Notice that fluorine has proton number 9, meaning it has electron arrangement 2.7. Two electrons in its inner shell, while seven electrons in its outermost shell. Similarly, chlorine has proton number 17, and its electron arrangement is 2.8.7. Chlorine also has 7 electrons in its outermost shell. Likewise, bromine having proton number 35 has electron arrangement 2.8.18.7. Bromine also has 7 valence electrons. This is the reason these elements are placed in group 17. And they share similar physical and chemical properties. The halogen group elements exist as diatomic molecules at room temperature. This means two atoms are required to make them exist in stable condition at room temperature. So, why do they exist as diatomic molecules? Well, this is because halogen elements are highly electronegative, meaning they easily attract electrons. Hence, the outermost shell of halogen elements easily share their valence electron with another identical halogen atom. Now, both the identical atom has 8 valence electron in outermost shell, achieving a complete shell electron arrangement. Next, let's see the trend of some of the physical properties as we move down the group 17 elements from fluorine to iodine. Firstly, the atomic size increases. Interestingly, the melting point increases as we move down the group. The boiling point of halogens also increases as we move down the group. What's the reason for this? Well, first of all, as we move down the group, the atomic size of the elements increases. As such, the attractive forces between molecules become stronger. These forces are also known as intermolecular forces or van der Waal forces. As the forces become stronger, more heat is required to overcome the forces. Halogens are important in the use of products in our daily lives. However, they are used in their compound forms. For example, fluorine is used in our dental care products. Chlorine is used as disinfectants or in cleaning products. Bromine are used as pesticides and finally iodine which are used as antiseptic. 
I hope the video helped you to understand more about halogens. That's all for now. Thank you.